Hello, today it's Call the Orkin Man Cupcakes. First take some of these little craft caramel cubes that are soft and just flatten them out with your fingers. If they're too hard, you can put them in the microwave for a few seconds to soften them. The best place to do this is on a piece of a sheet of wax paper because they come off a lot easier, they don't stick. Then using a clean pair of kitchen scissors, you're just gonna cut the corners off basically to make an oval shape. And then cut a slit down the center of the oval, almost all the way to the top. And then I'm just rounding off the the edges there and then using a knife you're just going to make some little lines lengthways and this is going to be the um, the, the wing covers that's on that you can see on the cockroach then you're gonna need a pitted date and a half of an M&M and the best way to co cut an M&M in half I found was to take a sharp serrated knife and just gently saw back and forth across the center of the m and until you get a little groove and then press down and cut it. You'll get hopefully at least one good half that way. I had issues doing that and you'll see it at the end of the video. Then some chocolate icing in a Ziploc bag, cut the corner off just enough so that you can get a narrow line like that. And then just put some of the chocolate icing on the end of the date. And then you're gonna add the wing covers or the top and just, just spread them along over there along the length of it and flare out the edges of it. Then flatten the end with your finger and then put a little bit of icing and that's what you're going to use as a glue to glue on the half of the M&M which is the head. Just like that. And then you're going to frost a cupcake. In, retro, in retrospect, I think that a different color icing would have been better because it would have been made more of a contrast to the uh, the little cockroach. But I've used chocolate in this case. Just spreading a little bit of dry cereal on here to make it look like dirt or pieces of food that are on the floor that the cockroach is going after. And then you're gonna put some details on to the little bug. So starting from the head, you're gonna push and pull, squeeze some little antenna. And if it breaks off, we'll just start where you left off. Two little antennae along the sides the cockroach and then you're going to pipe on a little leg so start start from the body and go downward and you need six of them because insects have six legs and then that's pretty much it I think you'd have been able to see the legs and everything else better if it would have been chocolate icing on the base but all in all it's actually a pretty realistic looking little bug this would be an excellent Halloween cupcake Why did the rancher take his cow to the vet? Because it was moody.